Good afternoon friends, I am Dr. Prabodh, I am going to speak on a very different topics, entrepreneurship. We have heard that entrepreneurs, they make the country and create the wealth by doing an innovation. But then I thought many of us do the jobs in various organizations. What are the qualities which are required to make you successful employee? The successful employee requires a quality called entrepreneurship. What is entrepreneur? It is nothing but entrepreneur but having within and working for others. If you see the successful entrepreneurs, we have a Steve Jobs, we have Harsh Mariwala for Mariko, we have Ramesh Chavan for Parles. So many, they have made the empire out of nothing. But if you see the entrepreneurs, we have a successful CEOs and MD. There are a lot of things to learn from those CEO and MD to make your career flourish. I do not think it is only your own journey. As a successful manager, as a successful employee, as a successful director, as a successful managing director, it is your responsibility to take that organization up, not for yourself, it is for the entire country. We require a good leader and they are intrapreneurs. If you see who are the intrapreneurs which we can get the example, it could be, it could be Google CEO, Mr. Pichai, Indra New York Pepsi, we talked about, she is the top 50 most influenced person on the earth, but she is an employee. I was thinking about the qualities of the intra, intrapreneurs, what are those qualities, I just listed out. The number one quality is risk taking ability. These are the successful employees, they do something differently, what they do, risk taking ability, they take the risk within the frame of organization, innovation and creativity. They do the job with little innovation and some creativity. So they do not repeat the things again and again. It is very, very important part of innovation and creativity. Third important point is flexibility, managing the diverse condition. You will see that the people who are failure in one year because employees cannot successful all the time. The bad patch comes in everybody's life. How you bounce back is more important. What are your learnings? They sharpen their skills and they fight with the adverse condition, come out with the condition with their thoughts. They are also very good motivator and team player. So they are a leaders. They can influence the non-reporting members. If you have this quality of influencing non-reporting member, you are an entrepreneur. They are also very good in the time management and networking. They understand the value of networking, they do not go to the people when you are in need, rather they connect, they nurture, they nourish the relations, they are called the networking ability in a positive sense. Plus, they have many other qualities, but I thought that if you go into this, the CEOs, these are the qualities and the last but not least, integrity and trust, which is impeccable quality of the good inter entrepreneur. Friends, Today we are going through the very actually a different phase of the food industry and just we are changing the gear. We require good entrepreneurs because as per the statistics, only 7 percent people can start their own business and sustain, 40 percent people will be doing the job. What about the success about the employees? Who will tell that these employees need to be successful? So as a good entrepreneur, you can take one of the qualities, you need not to be expert in all. but you can be expert in one of those and all the best to your journey as an employee and let us make India shine. Thank you.